Hey guys, it's your girl here, Jishin, and I'm back with a quick tutorial from the... I had on a blue and white shirt in my last video, and one of the ladies, a um, couple of the ladies actually that subscribed to me, asked me if I can do a look, and one of the ladies in the group that I'm in um, on Facebook, she asked me if I could do a tutorial for the look because she needs help with applied makeup. I referred her to the YT because I was like, I don't do makeup, but if you want me to do a tutorial on the look, I'll do it just for you, for you guys. So they said, yes, go ahead and do it. My face is already prepped with foundation. Um, when I'm done, I'm going to go back in and clean up and put powder on. But you guys will see all that. So let's get this started. I am going to prime my eyes with the Ruby Kisses primer. And if I'm looking straight ahead, it's because I have a mirror straight ahead of me. I'm going to go ahead and rub that all the way in. Oh, and I am going to talk about this hair I have on. So, stay tuned for my next video with this. Now I'm going to let that dry and I'm going to get my eyebrows done. I'm doing the NYX Eyebrow Eyeshadow Pencil. It's in black. I'm just going to fill them in a little bit. And I'm going to go over that with my brow brush. Just so that it's not a harsh black. And it blends blends it in with my blends the pencil in with my eye. Eyebrows. Okay, now that we got that done and my primer is probably, I'm having a wicked breakout. Excuse the breakout that's going on right now. Okay, let's get started. Now I'm going to go into my Naked palette and I'm going to take Half Bake, that right there, and I'm going to pack that on with I think this is my 239, 232. I don't know. My Mac brush, that's what I'm packing it on. On the just on the very lid. Try not to go over the lid. Try not to get any in your crease. Just pack it on. Pack, 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 pack it on. Now that I've got that packed on, I am going to take my blending brush. This is a C200 Deluxe Crease. I think it's from Sigma. And I'm just going to blend so that we don't have any harsh line windshield motion. Next, I am going to take... This brush, I don't know the name of it. Whatever. I'm going to take this and I'm going to get Hustle, this color right here, and I'm going to put that in my outer V and then I'm going to blend that inward. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Okay, then I'm going to take my blending brush and I'm going to blend that. I'm going to take the same color on my blending brush and get in there a little bit more. Again, I'm not a makeup artist, so I don't know terminology, so I just say what it sounds like to me. Okay? And then I'm going to go in with my angled. This is from e.l.f. The Fine Eye Brush. And I'm going to take Creep, that black, shimmer black, and I'm going to put it like right here in the crease and just blend it a little bit. Right there. Okay. I'm going to go back on the outside of that with a little bit more creep. But if you have it, you can use it's like a purplish, brownish color like a dark purple like a purple brown okay and then i'm going to take my brush and i'm just going to pat a little bit more of the high fake one because i really want the gold to pop okay Next, I am going to take the same blending brush, and I have a brown that kind of matches my complexion, and I'm just going to go right above the crease to blend so it could transition into my brow highlight. Next, I am going to take my high bright high brow highlight, which is rice paper from MAC, and I'm just going to put a little bit on my brush, brush, and then I'm just going to put that right there and blend some of that out. I'm going to take my finger that's clean and I'm just going to pat next I am going to take my liner from Urban Decay it is in smog and I'm just gonna do my line I'm gonna start on the outer because I want it kind of of a wing effect if you know what I mean. And I'm trying to leave my line as thin as I can possibly get it. Okay. Next, I am going to take my NYX eyebrow eye pencil in black and I'm just going to go my waterline with this next I'm going to take my YSL mascara and I am just going to use a little bit of this 
on my eyebrows. Mm -hmm. I mean, on my eyelashes, excuse me. And then I am going to take my favorite Maybelline The Fallsies Volume Express. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go back in with that. And that's the eye look, very easy. And then I'm going to go in with my Make It Forever Velvet, matte velvet, just a tiny bit of it, about that much. And I will take my Sonia Kasha brush, foundation brush, and I'm just going to clean up underneath the eyes. Okay, now I'm going to go in with my NARS Exhibit A, and I'm going to take my big fan brush, and I'm just going to blush my brush on. I like to put my blush on before I do my powder, and I like to use a fan brush because of the look it gives me. Next, I'm going to take the same brown that matches my complexion, and I am going to go in with my angled bronzing brush, and I'm just going to go into right here to give me that, to highlight my cheeks, make my cheekbones pop, even though I don't need it because I have high cheekbones, but that's a little extra I do. Then you just blend that out. Now I'm going to go in with my CoverGirl from the Queen Collection. This is the bronzer in the Q120. And I'm just going to set my foundation. Now for my lips, I already moisturized my lips. I'm not going to line them. What I am going to do, I'm going to take MAC, all of my Purple Life from the Guru collection they had. And I'm just going to line around my lips with that. And then I'm going to go in with Mauve from NYX. 